Formation finished for Volvo and for Renault with Rydell and Rademacher in two and three. Plato. The thoughts only went a little bit wide. Hayden went through. Then Hayden missed the gear or something. I don't know. I sometimes wonder if the riders know what's happening. They really go at it. They're so focused. They really are. Look at these two neck and neck as they go down. Oh, they're shoulder charging each other. It's more like rugby. Emmett gave Troy Bayliss a bash with his right shoulder. Move over. That's my piece of road. No, it isn't, said the Australian. Yes, it is, said Sean Emmett. I'm on the inside for the hairpin. I've got the tarmac and I'm in front. He is only just marginally. Reynolds in third. They're now easing away just by two bike lengths from Neil Hodgson and still very much in touch is James Hayden. Roger, what a race. It's absolutely fantastic. There's five guys here. Their will to win is phenomenal. Look at them diving across each side of the circuit. None of them want to give anything away. They all form back into formation. 130 mile an hour, lean it right, squirt on the power through Nickerbrook, up over the blind brow here at Clay Hill before Druids. And if you've got your energy back, Barry, let's take them through Lodge for the last time. This is the last lap, as Roger said. Away they go then under the bridge. Look over the shoulder from Sean Emmett. There's a tail ender ahead of them. Will he stay out of the way? They're choosing all sorts of lights. A foot off the footrest. Bayliss has gone through. He's gone wide. Emmett's stolen the march. Can Reynolds grab second? Fighting back again. There's contact there. I, I don't know who got the win. It was neck and neck. Emmett thinks he's got it. Emmett thinks he has taken the win. And, oh, that's an almighty crash. That's Paul Young, the privateer, coming in on the last lap. That is an almighty crash. And the marshal signalling for assistance. Bayliss, too, thinks he's got the win. It's anyone's guess, as they say in the horse racing game, this has to be a photo finish. Sean Emmett got the verdict by one thousandth of a second from Troy Bayliss. Phenomenal. In fact, half a second separated the top five. Sean, second in the first race today. What a fantastic win. Yeah, I have to say, you know, um, first race this morning was... ...crash that Paul Young had, but I can tell you after some examination in the medical centre, Paul Young, with a small shoulder injury, could easily be back to race again at Knock Hill. So whilst the bike was destroyed, Paul Young will march on. A healthy 62-point lead for Paul Young, but reigning champion Phil Giles, back after seven weeks with a broken femur, took the second race win for the privateer. Who? Others weren't so lucky, to the delight of the local spectators.